Alright guys, what's up? And today I got another tutorial for you guys. Um, today is going to be how to add custom textures to any object in Cinema 4D. Now this is probably one of the most requested tutorials I have ever gotten. Um, and it was actually because of one video. Um, it was a free intervention object video from Modern Warfare 2 if you haven't played that. Um, but yeah, so today I'm going to be showing you how to add custom textures to um, any object and I'm going to be adding a um, custom texture to the intervention which is from the other video because this is pretty much why the video got requested was because of that video so that's why I'm going to be doing that but um, this will work for any object and for any other texture you want so what you're going to do first is open up Cinema 4D and um, you're going to open up your project or your uh, your uh, object or make it whatever you're doing and as you can see here it is just a gray intervention um, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to either make your uh, your texture you can uh, open up Photoshop or paint whatever you want to do and uh, you know create a nice little texture and then add it um, or you can download one off the internet which is what I did um, it is very simple all you would need to do is go to Google and type in um, fall camo modern warfare 2 and go to images and then you would find the best fall camo which is a picture right here now this is in a very um, big picture so it might look a little worse um, but you know this is just for the sake of the tutorial you'll save it to your desktop and name it fall and hit save and once that's downloaded you will go back into cinema 4d and you will double click on the material section and create a new material double click on the material to open up the editor and then make sure you're on the color tab and go to texture the drop down and load image and then you'll go to your desktop scroll down until you find your fall picture open and do you want to create a copy no and there you go now you have your fall camo picture thingy actually that's supposed to be black I don't know why I did that so yeah pretty much um, make it as realistic as you can po if you possibly can um, it's there's a lot of parts that are supposed to be black that aren't that you can't now if I make a new material and make this black and add a little bit of a reflection and make that as the scope and that and now render it out as you can see it has fall camo and there's no background I'll add a sky so that you can just see it if we render it out now as you can see got fall camo on it nice looking um, you can see there's a little bit of pixels in the fall because that was a very small picture you might want to find a bigger one than that but yeah that's pretty much it guys um, this will work for any object uh, just a simple cube like this it will uh, it will work for it you can go ahead and add fall to this cube there you go pretty cool so um thanks for watching guys uh, hope you enjoyed hope this helped um, and yeah, until next time guys, peace.